everyone, it's Darla from Crafty Yarn Owl. Welcome. So what's happening today is I have this huge bin. I can't even get the lid on it. Uh, no. <laughs> this huge bin of finished crocheted items. Now, a lot of these I have tutorials on, so I'll link those below if you want to make your own. Um, but I was watching Petra's Happy Place. Hi, Petra. And um, I'll leave her link below to a video that she put up recently. There's a couple that I've seen so far where she is um, decluttering and she is selling a few of her crochet items at giveaway prices practically. My oh my. And um, yeah, <laughs> so she she inspired me to and she didn't know I was thinking about this I was thinking about going through this bin and pulling out summer stuff to uh, donate to a local um, it's a women's resource center and uh, I've donated crochet items to them before so they're they uh, appreciate that and they receive them so um, I am going to email them to make sure you know they'll they'll take some more but um, yeah so Pedra you inspired me to get this done <laughs> so, um, so yeah like I said I'm gonna donate these things but I just I just thought I'd do it on camera um, if you are interested in purchasing any of these by all means let me know um, just let me know what you are able to pay that includes shipping and I know shipping is expensive but just you know guess at it or give an estimate or whatever and uh, so I'll leave this video up for let's see until probably Monday May 16th and if there's a few people who want the same item um, I'll choose the one who's offering more and I do want to use that money like to, to go towards this channel, but also to go towards a future giveaway of yarn. <laughs> yes. So um, let's take a look at what we have in here. I know there's, there's winter stuff, there's um, summer stuff. So right now it's summer stuff I'm going to be concentrating on. Uh, today's May 3rd. 2022 yesterday morning may 2nd we had snow yes we did i'm in winnipeg canada and i mean we've had a really really strange spring with snow um snowstorms rain thunder all kinds of crazy stuff as of one o'clock today now it's two o'clock we had a temperature of plus eight Celsius, which is, what was it now, 46 Fahrenheit. Woohoo! that's awesome for us. So, but it's supposed to get warmer as the week goes. Oh, I'm so happy. Um, so, um, yeah, it's been crazy. Uh, a lot of people's, uh, a lot of towns around Winnipeg have been flooding. I mean, rivers going through their towns. So I ask for prayer for those people and for the farmers, for their fields and animals and everything. Lord Jesus, just take care of them all. Give them peace and comfort. All right, so let's go through this, all right? Let's go through this. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I'm gonna put a number, um, like number one, two, three, on each item. Um, and if you're interested, by all means, I, I would love to sell things to you too, but uh, some things are, um, I'd like to donate, of course. Um, oh, what am I wearing? Let's just look at what I'm wearing. This is actually one of my most popular tutorials. I was really surprised by that, <laughs> just because I'm just little old me. I mean, anyway, so this top has worked side to side and the only seams you have to make are down the sides here. You can make the neckline, you know, a little higher up if you like. I think I give all the multiples. I'm sure I give all the multiples and everything. But, you know, I thought if, you know, if you have like striped yarn, this was a Karen cotton cake. 
you have striped yarn, maybe you'd like the stripes to run down, maybe it'll give you a, I don't know. It's, I think it's a more slimming look. I don't know, I put on some poundage though, you know, but anyway. <laughs> so this is it, this is the back, and I have the neckline go down a little bit on the back as well, so it's not pressing right against your neck, I mean, because it is for summer. Um, so yeah, uh, I will put the link to this below, to the tutorial. All right, let's get started. So number one, the first top I see right here is, this is a summer top. I just let the colors go where they wanted to. And um, I will, of course, link all the tutorials that I have for whatever I show you. Some, I see one I did not make myself, but I will try to find the tutorial for that when I show it to you and uh, you can make it if you like. Um, all right, so this is, it's about a size medium. Um, yeah, this one has like a fancy stitch going down the front and the back and the other stitches are V stitches and, oh yes, it has the fancy stitch going along the top of the shoulder. Um, yeah, so that's number one. So donate or sell, whatever happens in the comments. <laughs> All right, so that's number one. And oh, this one here, this is a poncho. And this one, I don't even know what yarn this was, but uh, it's, it's a design by Bag of Day. And I just thought it was so pretty. It's like a mesh, a mesh stitch. So yeah, hi Crystal. I will try to link her tutorial if I remember which one it was. But this is really pretty. All right, so what else? Okay, we have this one here. Um, this one, mm, yes, I'm pretty sure this was the same, same design as the one I'm wearing, although I misjudged my own size. <laughs> so I had to add a bunch of rows, I just went around. This is the one made from side to side. Then I just went around adding a bottom to it. And um, it's a bunch of blues and sparkly sparkly so that'll be number three uh donate or sell um okay this one's a winter so that uh, oh <laughs> i might be doing another one for winter closer to winter maybe well i will be donating some more uh i don't know if i'll be showing them in I should, I should give you guys a chance to, to buy them if you want. Um, what is this one? Um, okay, let's see, let's see. Okay, so this one is also one of my designs. Um, this, I, I misjudged myself again and made it too small, but it was, it can be a top, for a small person, can be um, a dress, um, a beach cover up, and I love the way that the purples kind of transition. And on the front at the top, right about here, is a skull. Yeah, so I did make myself another one that fits me. <laughs> So there's that one, I have a tutorial on that. So that's number four. So if you are interested in any of these, um, please let me know in the comments. Like I said at the beginning, okay, this is more of a winter one. Um, okay, here's, a, here's another one. This one, I just let the colors go where they wanted to. Um, yeah, so this is the same style as that number one I showed you, the very first one. 
has the fancy stitch there and on the shoulders and at the back. Um, this one I think was made out of a Luke's and threads. This may be, is this acrylic or polyester? I'm not sure. But, you know, you can wear it in the summer, um, loose, like a loose, loosely. <laughs> so that was number five. Now I lost my pen. Oh, there it is. Number five. Okay. This is, okay. More like winter ones. What else do I have here for summer? Um, there's this one. This one I designed. It can be made worn many different ways. It has a drawstring. Um, this one is fairly small too. This can be worn. Well, I'll put the tutorial below, but this can be worn um, as a top. Um, what do you call those tops? Like a long tube top with no straps. Um, it can be worn as a cowl. You put it around your neck. Uh, it can be worn as a skirt. Um, um, it can be worn on a cool day over your head and around your neck a little bit. There's many. I think there were seven different ways I figured out how this could be worn. So that's the stitch. There's the bottom, and that's where I put the drawstring through. I have, I have beads, little beads on the on the drawstring. Where's the other part of it? Right here, on both both ends. So yeah, this um, would fit maybe a small to maybe a medium. Um, Gosh, I think I put out a few pounds since I made this. But anyway, so that's that's number six. And uh, this is, hmm, did I design this? Yes, I did. I designed this one too. This is just a, I guess, a chalet. Where's a chalette? Oof. You can wear it off the shoulders and tie it in the front. You can wear it as a cowl. Um, like this. You can wear it oh, different ways. But yeah, that is my design too. And this yarn is what is this? Hmm. Might have been Hobie Universe, maybe? Um, it's sparkly, different shades of blue. So, yeah, there's that one. That one's number seven. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> I'm not cutting that out. That just shows I'm human. <laughs> so, that was number seven. Okay. Um, okay, this one. Oh, I don't know. Should I? I don't know if you're interested in this. Um, because, well, I use scrap yarn. I had a, I don't know, a couple of balls of, um, the heck was it? Mmm. Kara? Maybe Karen cotton cake? I don't know. But. This is a design by Cinnamon Stitches. Hi, Jennifer. So she had made hers pointed. Of course, I'll, I'll uh, try to find her tutorial and put it below, but um, hers was pointed or you could not point it at the back and front or just, just uh, in the front and not the back or whatever. So I decided not to make a point and I wish I had made a point because just wish I had. <laughs> but anyway, so this, this tank top is going for donation or if you 
guys, somebody wants to buy it, let me know. All right, number eight. Oh no, was that eight? Oh dear, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that was number eight. Okay, number eight. All right, now what do we have? Some more wintry ones I'm looking at right now. Um, I think that's it for this video. Yeah, the rest are number eight. I mean, number eight. <laughs> the last one was number eight. The rest are more like wintry. So, yeah, so that's it. So, let me know if you're interested in buying any otherwise. I'm going to uh, donate them, um, and I, I, I know I have other things to donate to them, so you don't have to think, oh, well, you know, I don't really want to buy it, I'd like you to, to be able to donate it. Don't worry about it. I, got, I have other things to donate to them. Um, so that's it, I guess. I coffee my second cup of coffee is ready I'm gonna have that and uh, I thank you so much for watching and uh, have a wonderful day thank you bye